What's up brothers and sisters? Today we are celebrating our brother Nijia. You know why? Victory is here! A, a big step this time. We've been celebrating very small, small steps. Mm -hmm. But today we are celebrating a very huge step. President Macron just announced yesterday on Sunday that he will be getting out his military and the ambassador from Niger and ending the military cooperation with Niger. Victory for the people of Niger. Africa is winning. Unity finally. has finally won. Do you know what we are expecting next? Mm -hmm. For the ECOWAS and the West to remove sanctions on Niger. I yeah. hope that, that is confirmed. Hopefully. So what happened yesterday? Mm -hmm. So yesterday was Sunday. Mm -hmm. And the military junta in Niger had announced that they are going to close the Niger's airspace mm -hmm. to the French, French military, military and, and commercial, commercial planes. So that was not going to affect any other flights mm -hmm. except French. Mm -hmm. And with that, uh, Macron said he spoke to to the former president, that the ousted president Mohamed Bazou, mm -hmm. and told him that we are going to remove our people from there. Yeah. But uh, you know, he said they don't recognize this new military government. Exactly. So we are. You're not going to, <laughs> to remove our military. I don't okay, so the, the, yeah, he claims that they had a call uh, or they spoke with Bazoom and he told him just for uh, for the sake of uh, releasing the tension that mm -hmm. is in the country, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's better if, you know, he removes, he removes he withdraws the, the, the mm -hmm. ambassador and the but, troops. But remember the ambassador. It's a pride, we know. <laughs> you have to succumb to the pressure. Yeah. And remember the ambassador was surviving on military rations. Exactly. I don't know what that exactly. is. Exactly. And the military was surviving on Dog food. Exactly. What's, so, what's that video on military surviving on dog food? It was, it was going to be hard. I think with the closing of the airspace, he, he, that is when he realized, no, man, yeah, this is taking took... things far. Because one, they, I know for sure the planes are the ones mm -hmm. that bring food yeah, for the yeah, army, yeah. Mm -hmm. they supply. So imagine everything is closed. And he said, eh, mm -hmm. he said that, uh, the military junta said that they are closing the airspace for France because they want to regain the control of the airspace. Exactly. Meaning, so it means they've been controlling so the airspace. It will be, it will be held in a way that they won't be able to, to access their people. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But um, victory to the people of Niger because over the past days they've been increasing, you know, the tension yeah. within and, the, the, the and the citizens mm -hmm. have been sleeping close to the military. even cooking for for people who are <laughs> who are who are taking the uh, night vigil yes around the around the military base uh, around the military yeah. base so it's victory you guys it shows that if africans were to unite yeah these are the results unity that we can get. unity is everything power now we continue and remember in the in the unga mm -hmm. uh, they were not allowed to present their grievances so exactly. they were represented by Burkina faso mm -hmm. and mali and they spoke and I think even that post Makut said... It showed him that these guys us. are not joking. So this is the new generation. France is losing, Africa is losing. <laughs> Three, <France> is losing. zero. <laughs> <laughs> so we are expecting more from Niger. We are expecting that the citizens will get what they deserve. Well, so, you know, it's a serious matter because even the activists supporting the military junta was like they need to get a, a deadline, like a straight deadline. Like, when are you removing? Because yeah, France yeah. was like, we'll be removing the troops, you know, by the slowly, the, by, you know, yeah, so that in, it doesn't bring in, war. So in, that... in collaboration with the judge, mm -hmm. because we need a peaceful mm -hmm. with the draw. Mm -hmm. But the activist says, we want, we want a deadline, yeah, we not don't, the end of don't, don't, You know, because they can say that and then see that the tension mm -hmm. has decreased and then relax. Yeah, you, you remember know? some weeks ago when Macron said we are going to remove them. Mm -hmm. Then when we went, we went to this G20, mm -hmm. he was like, no, we still don't recognize you the know, government. You know. so, yeah, so they really need to be But the straight. good thing about saying that was the ambassador and the military went went on safari. Yeah. Now I think they cried because they were suffering. Of course, they, they had to they, suffer. So they that have they, to go. They, they, they can go to Benin or Senegal. Okay, and child. and what what the funny thing is that Macron is like um, he claims that the Niger 
military doesn't want to fight terrorists. terrorists terrorism anymore yeah, that was so <laughs> so it's like you're pitting us you know oh you know too bad for you you don't want to fight terrorism we've been helping you fight terrorism when they have not even done anything yeah. to so, fight that so terrorism. they say we are we are it's it seems like those people the military, they are no longer interested in Niger fighting. doesn't is not interested in fighting military they're terrorists I don't know. and why islamic terrorists you know, guys, there's something like wh- why why do they ruin a very nice religion? religion. That's my problem because most people now recognize Muslims as With terrorists. terrorists. Yeah, and then you have painted the whole religion as bad people when it's actually yeah. a very nice religion that people follow and you know it takes it's them to crazy. their destination. It's crazy. So <sighs> but, uh, it's time for them to go. They've already. In fact, I, the thing that I hated is that they they. They, they paint them as Islamic terrorists, terrorists you know? Yeah, it's yeah. not just terrorists. Mm-hmm. It's specifically Islamic terrorists. Yeah. And uh, we, we saw in the UNGA, every leader from the very can- four countries, actually, mm-hmm. Mali, Mali, Burkina Faso, and Niger together, and Guinea, mm-hmm. saying that these are imperialist posting and terrorists. Yeah, it's terrorists. So it's them funding some people mm-hmm. to post as Islamic terrorists to ruin a religion and ruin the lives of people. So it doesn't make sense. It's time for them but to you know what, guys? We are winning. Africa is winning and we are here to celebrate with you. So subscribe as we celebrate together. Don't forget to comment down below, and share like, the video, yeah, also like. like. We shall see you on the comment section. Victory okay. to Niger! May Africa win. Long live Niger. Long, long live, live Africa. Long, long live, live Sahel. Long live everyone. Long live Africa. Short live Macron. <laughs> <laughs> see you in the next we'll one. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.